Hello everybody, it's Dazran303 and welcome back to Go Vacation Let's Play. And in the last episode, I left you here on the mountain resort. I was just going paragliding and I'm about to resume just where I left off. So if you didn't see the last episode, you're probably looking at my shoes going, what is he wearing? What is he wearing on his shoes? They are shoes that kind of remind me of Tingle. <laughs> Tingle from the Legend of Zelda. <laughs> right, so let's talk to this person and let's go and do some paragliding. Come on. Welcome, must feel great, Diamond. All right, okay, sure. Uh, so what we're going to do here again is we're going to do some. Um, oh, I'm after going into bungee jumping by mistake. <laughs> Can an episode of Go Vacation just ever go well for me? Can I stop making mistakes? I mean, so many times in this Let's Play, I've gone looking for a certain game mode, and I walk and talk to the wrong person. <laughs> Over here. That's this. There we go. This little girly. Right. Okay, so high scoring enthusiasts, be sure to check out these scores I'm setting here and get in your video responses. Uh, what you're going to be doing is going into aimed flight. You're going to be trying to beat my scores here, so uh, as we did stage number two in the last episode, we're going to continue on with stage number three. So, stage number three. Uh, just like the other one, you're trying to fly through all the... Um, the bullseye spots on these targets and you want to get the maximum score you can so you're gonna have to go through this a bit fast because as you can see on the right side of the screen your score is going down every second that you're out on the on the mountain so that's a bullseye but the only way to really speed up is to kind of um, make yourself go into a dead fall by holding Z and B I don't know if that's very beneficial Maybe you guys can try it. Let's see if you can beat my time with that technique. I'm gonna try and come in here at an angle so we can catch that updraft. Keep it going. That is another bullseye for the All-State Champion. 50 points as well. So I have managed, oh, we're getting a red symbol on screen. That means you're getting close to the ground. You can't get too close or you kind of get warped back up to the sky, which I'm sure would add add on a lot of uh, unnecessary time. So we need to swoop up. No, we're not. Alright. That was tough. Right, where's the next one? Oh, there's two up, three up here, is there? Oh, look at this. The way the last two are, they're kind of angled, so you're going to have to come through them from from top to bottom. That's pretty easy. Get a bit of a speed boost, hopefully. Hopefully that'll add on to my score. Now I have to go up pretty high for this one. And then we're dropping in. We have to actually get the next uh, updraft. And then we're coming in from the top. Going all the way down for the next two targets. Alright, let's see if we can do this. We're on a pretty good score already. We had to get 400. We've already got 400. Oh no, I've only got 30 points for that, and that's another 30 points. 580 total score, with a time of 2 minutes and 73 split seconds. I think they're split seconds. If anyone can correct me on that one, uh, be sure to do so. Because it's the only opportunity I will give you to correct me, and I won't be annoyed. <laughs> oh, plain sailing through that bullseye right there. Alright, that is stage number 3, now we're going to move on to stage number 4. Uh, we only had to get 400 points, I got 580. Pretty cool. See if you can beat that score. Uh, submit a video response if you did with your run. And I will, of course, check out the video, give it a like, comment on it, perhaps. All that good stuff. Right, stage number four. Let's see if I can get a better score because I missed out on two bullseyes. Jesus, I took my hand off the handle rail. <laughs> the handlebar. Whatever it's called. I'm a freaking paraglider. Alright, we got four minutes to do this. We don't need all that. If you look at the map as well, it's a pretty straight run at this. Straight-ish. There's a couple of them in a row. There's, there's one, there's two. Then there's like three in a row, then there's another three in a row. Let's see. What do you mean, three? Don't you mean three? <laughs> Hopefully that gave me a bit of a speed boost again. I'm not really sure about that technique. Oh, crap. Uh, we're looking pretty good here. That is fan fantastic. 
Alright, 50 points again. So we have to actually to beat this game and get a... Not so much a silver key, but yeah, really you have to... I think you have to beat the, all the scores inside these little games. Like this one here. The last one was 400. This one is 450. So we're on 250. And we've got that uh, score going down every second. 300. All we need is another 2. Uh, 3 to be sure. To be sure, to be sure. He's on 350. Alright, that's 400. What is there... Why is there an updraft over there? Is this wise? Oh no, I missed one! Damn it. I missed one trying to do my turn. Right. So that gives you guys a nice bit of leeway to get a victory there by getting all your bullseyes. Uh, finished off with 663, another 3 points, and you guys would have been calling me the devil. So that was pretty good. Pretty good run. I think I was uh, put off by the starting uh, animation there where my character took his hand off the little handle of the paraglider. Really scared me there, so kind of nervous going through that one. 663 was my final score. If you can beat that. And uh, now we're moving on to the last one in aimed flight. It's stage number 5. Usually comes after number 4. It's stage 5. Let's see what we can do in this one. Let's see if we can get all bullseyes this time. For God's sakes. That's it. Keep your hands on the handles. <laughs> right. We're going for a good, unbeatable score in this one. As I'm sure Nilly will be will be out to make me look silly. <laughs> right. All bullseyes. As a promise to my viewers. Over here on Desran Trio 3 LP. Uh, just to ask you guys a question as well, a question to the viewers. Uh, how would you feel now if I was to still do this Let's Play throughout the release of the Nintendo Wii U? Would that bother you much at all? Um, you know, the Wii U is coming out, everyone wants to see Wii U stuff. Would you still watch Nintendo Wii content? Because I do plan to do a lot of Wii content still. Uh, maybe even revisiting the GameCube and so on. Uh, I have so many projects I would love to do, but it's really hard to find the time to do them all. I would love to do a, like a series of um, I don't know going through the missions and oh no a golden eye <laughs> and other such games I want to do a let's play series of Pikmin uh, I've always wanted to do Battalion Wars but for some reason I just don't have the time it's it's a pretty long perplexing game with all the different but configurations and oh yeah <laughs> where am I going now have I got them all so far I hope I have. There's no indication to say I have got the little dots on the map behind me. They're not ticked or anything like that. We'll just continue on our journey. Uh, I will try my best to get some more episodes out there of Let's Plays and so on. I'm sure you can expect a lot of Let's Plays on this channel. Um, I'm sure I will do a Legend of Zelda game of some kind at some stage. No, go down. Oh, that is, it's actually kind of tough to do this. <laughs> As I say, with every game I play on Go Vacation, this is really tough. <laughs> Making excuses for myself. I used to have an excuse before. It used to work very well. I used to have long hair. Very long hair. And I'd always say, oh, my hair was in my eyes for that one. I couldn't see. <laughs> Can't do that anymore. I have to think up for new ones. It's not going so well. Right, are we at the end? Is this the goal? Oh right, here we go. It's a nice little turning one coming up. Could this be a perfect run from Desert Tree Tree on something in Go Vacation? I think it is! 681! Whew! Time left, 1 minute and 21 seconds, point nine one. That was a pretty good run, I have to say. I think I got all the bullseyes. That was the first run on a stage on paragliding that I got all the bullseyes in this episode of Go, Vac Go Vacation. Episode 58, I believe. Episode 50 frickin' 8. <sighs> you won a silver key! That's where Trio Tree aimed flight. Clear all stages. And I have done so. Alright, so I guess to mix it up, should I do something else? Uh, you know what, let's try one of the 
balloon burst just to see what that is like. I can't remember. I haven't played it in so long. I have not been to the mountain resort in ages to do some paragliding. All right, balloon burst. Uh, stage number two. Let's check it out and see if it's any easier than the flying through the bullseyes of aimed flight. <laughs> Green shoes. Oh, this is going to take ages to do. There's loads of updrafts. There's not many balloons. There's only seven. But it's going to take ages to get over there to the castle. What am I going to do in the meantime? So all you have to do is tip off the balloons. I think even if your character doesn't tip off the balloons, just your paraglider hits off the balloon. You're okay, which is very strange. But anyway, we'll use that to our advantage. Jeez, you're given six minutes to do this. And that's probably in case you miss a balloon or two. Hey, hey! Oh, there's one up here. Alright, so five left. This will be four. Four left after this one. Yes, there is. Alright, not too bad. Not too bad so far. Um, I'm not sure what you would... Yeah, well... If you wanted to challenge this, I guess you would try and get a faster time than I am getting right here, so... That seems to give you a bit of a boost, but you do lose a lot of ground. Anyway, we'll see. Woohoo! <laughs> Right, there's two left up here, so there's one just above me right here. If I get that, that will be done in... Great timing, I believe. And that is it! We are going to descend straight down to the ground. I don't think I'll make it. No, I didn't. <laughs> uh, one minute and 39 seconds that all it took. We were given six minutes, so... One minute, 39, and... 33 cent. That's what you have to beat if you want to try Balloon Buster stage number two. Alright, I'm going to quit that. And we're going to see what other games we can do on the mountain resort before we head back to the villa resort this time. I don't know, I think I've got a, a bit of a a bit of a fever. I'm itching to go back to the city resort for more dancing. <laughs> Off-road car. So, I think we're going to go up to the kayaking this time. Uh, see what's the story up there, so we're just going to go into the map really quickly. Uh, number eight is, of course, kayaking. Now, you can actually click here, and it will bring you all the way up here without having to drive up, but I like driving up. I think it makes it more enjoyable for the series. <laughs> but I'm not going to drive up this, Joe. No way. No siree, Bob. Takes way too long. Get out of the way, sheep! Okay, we're getting around this... Uh, Peculiar, sh peculiar, peculiar shape. A pecker. I mean peculiar shape. <laughs> and we're going up here to the... If we go up the straight here, we can go to the left. And we will be at paragliding. I mean, not paragliding. Whatever it's called. Frickin' kayaking. Let's see what we have to do in kayaking. I thought the last time I was here in the mountain resort and I did kayaking, I thought I had everything done, but I must be mistaken. I guess I am mistaken a small bit. It looks almost like it's night time up here. Oh my god. I'm pressing buttons here as if I'm paragliding. <laughs> I'm pressing buttons that don't need to be pressed. Right. Let's go, let's go. Right, so just up here. And here we are at Shanga Peak. And where is it? Where's the kayaking lady? There she is! <laughs> right, let's see what we have to do here at kayaking. What games are left for me to do? Right, uh, to get a silver key. River race, clear all stages, river salon, clear all stages, and coin collect. Ooh, freaking coin collect. Uh, I've done river race, have I? There's five stages. What about coin collect? How many stages is there? Five. Is River Salam going to be any different? No, it's not. Okay, let's do stage number two of River Salam. It wasn't too long ago I was doing some salams or shalams. I can't remember what you guys said it was in the comment section. Um, oh no, how do I do this again? Turn, goddammit. 
What the hell is going on? What kind of... What? Oh, hang on a second. Oh, this is annoying. <laughs> I didn't realize you had to steer with the analog stick. That's... That's peeing me off. Whoa! Holy crap! <laughs> Get up out of that. Right, I'm sure there's a way of uh, falling off these waterfalls. Not tilting over your boat. But I haven't mastered it yet. What if we just do nothing? Oh, that seems to work. Just leaving it in neutral, guys. I'm trying to beat this score here, then. I've already missed a flag because I don't know how to steer, so I guess I've given you guys a pretty good head start. Woohoo! Oh, yes! That was very close. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to get awarded that one. Oh. Right, so we're given two minutes total time to finish this one. And there's the finish line. You get way extra time than you need. I doubt I'm going to get one minute 30. Yeah, one minute and 26. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Alright, that was a bad time. That was a bad time, but easy for you guys to beat. So make sure you get your uh, video responses in to 1 minute and 26.70 uh, with one flag miss. Right, so let's do stage number 3 really quickly. Let's get to stage number 3 of... what was it? River Salome. Salom, Shalom. River Salam. Salami. River Salami. Let's do it. Hey! River Salami. <laughs> Alright, three minutes this time. I'm not sure if this is the... I don't think this is the mountain resort. It looks like a real jungle... Uh, jungly kind of tropical trees around and stuff. Look that kind of stuff and things. That's what it looks like. Alright, we're on this rock. Champion! Just out to break records. And have people swearing at their computers. For not being able to beat the times. <laughs> Let's see if I can paddle all the way down without stopping. Oh. Uh oh. No, I tipped over, I think. No, I didn't. I thought I did. Yeah, but def this is not the mountain resort. Where the hell is this? Why can't you explore around this place? This looks really cool. Don't miss a flag, Desmond. Don't miss a flag. Go as fast as you can. Whoa. <laughs> that was close. Touched off the yellow thing. On the right side of it, though. It's always good. Right, we're past the 1 minute 26 mark, which I got the last time. But this is a longer course, obviously. As it is stage number 3. Ugh. Oh. No! Five second delay! Damn it! I was really trying there to get a good time. Should have just kept it handy. Take, taking it easy. Alright, you guess the finish line. No, it's not. I'm still going. Two minutes now. Hey. Yeah, this is definitely not the mountain resort. Holy crap! What the hell just happened to my boat? <laughs> oh man. That wasn't even fair, like. <laughs> just threw me into a death for spiral. Oh, come on. God damn it. Alright, that was stage number three in my green boots. The man with his aqua blue hair, like. Where is he going? With that kind of hair, like. Start activity. Going to go into River Salome again. Stage number four. Should we do stage number four and five to finish out this episode? Um, not sure. I'm not sure, but I'm happy. All right, two minutes and thirty seconds. This one is. I don't know if it's of the same length because you don't get as much time. Oh come on! Oh, there's rocks everywhere here. Oh come on! 
No, I've already missed the flag. That's not good. It's kind of tricky, this one. Actually, there's a lot of flags. There's a lot of bends going on here. <laughs> oh, we're going into this cave again. I remember this cave. Uh, I think I did this kayaking with four people in the... No, it wasn't kayaking, was it? Was it kayaking? I think it was in uh, one of the previous episodes of Go Vacation. Whoa! No, don't turn over! <laughs> oh, God. I was upside down going into the water there. With the cheery music and everything. There could have been rocks down there. I could have broken my face. Oh, what a turn. Don't miss it. That was silly. That was silly, people. Is there a treasure boat there? I guess so. Well, not a treasure boat, a pirate ship. There we are. Reminds me of uh, the Marine Resort. Maybe it is the Marine Resort on the other side of it. Not sure, actually. Oh, stop with the bends. Oh, when you stop paddling, you totally lose control of your turning ability. I wish I'd have known. Obviously you can't steer when you're not paddling. Woohoo! Two minutes and one second. That's a pretty abysmal time. I'm sure you guys can beat the two minute mark. If you don't get any mistakes and not miss the flags like I did. I'm sure you guys can get well under two minutes in that one. Two minutes and one with three flag mistakes, which is obviously 15 seconds. So if you want to take off that 15 seconds, what was my best time? Leave it below in the comments, because I can't think. I'm not even going to waste my time thinking. <laughs> River of Salome, stage number five. Let's get this one completed. I think we get a silver key for this. Then we have to come back and do the coin collect, as well as the river race. Yeah. Target time, three minutes and 45 seconds. I reckon this is going to be an endurance race. So just like the paragliding, can we make this last run at this a flawless race? But we don't we don't miss anything. Just like I got all the bullseyes in paragliding. Can I get all the flags here? And I hear some of you saying no straight away. It's very unsettling. <laughs> oh god. Man, these are tough. This game is tough. I don't know if I ever said that before. What's the story with this one up ahead? It's on a bend. Woohoo! I think I've missed one. Oh, that was so unfortunate. Damn it. I've missed two now. Maybe that's why they give you so much time. Maybe they think uh, you're going to miss a couple of flags here and there. Yes. Yes, sir, Bob. I think I'll be doing all right if I can get away with just missing those two flags, and that's it. Ugh. One minute 45 gone. Do it pretty well. Haven't missed a flag since those two. Have I just jinxed myself? No, there's that boat again. They're the exact same location. Oof. That was close. Oh, this is great. I think I'm actually just starting to get the hang of this. See? More excuses. No! Frickin' rock came out of nowhere! Even though I saw it ages ago, I don't know what happened. I just didn't calculate for it. God damn it. I'm not sure, but I think this course like just changed. That boat was there before, but this this bit wasn't. I don't think. I'm not. I'm not sure. I can't. I haven't had any big falls yet. Ooh, that was close. And there's the finish line. Oh, here's the big fall. No, it's not a big fall. It was before. Remember. This is a different area. 
Three minutes and two seconds. With three flag errors. I think I got two really close together at the start, which was very unfortunate, ruining my time. And I had the one there just towards the end. But still, I get a silver key. So that is three minutes and two seconds, point one six. I want to try and beat that with three mistakes. Uh, pretty unfortunate. Definitely a very unfortunate run there I had. Very, very unfortunate. <laughs> right, so we're going to make our way down to the... Down to the information center, I guess. I think you're getting the hang of this kayaking thing. Right, last time I was up here, I think I went and did a kayak run off the river down. I think I'm going to drive down this time. I couldn't be bothered. It's too slow. It's too slow with the kayak. Oh, let's get a picture taken. <laughs> yeah, take the picture, god damn you. Alright, let's see what kind of picture he's going to take of us. What kind of... I think I got this picture taken before in one of the episodes. Oh yes, at the dolmen. That's what it's called, a dolmen. It's a burial site for a king or something. Something that shows off the shoes. I didn't press A! Oh, I think the timer ran out. Oh well, save the photo book. So hopefully that's another picture taken on the mountain resort. Hopefully. As I think um, at the start of episode 57... Lily was telling us that we only had three pictures taken on the Mount Resort at this time of day, which is appalling. So let's hope that eradicated the whole scenario. I have no idea what I just said. I think I just blacked out. Whoa! <laughs> Big exclamation mark and he flew back with it. Oh, come on. Let's drive, drive. Woohoo! Oh, that is some driving. Woohoo! That is some driving. Right, which way to go? Down the bumpy road? I think so. That's the best way to travel. Let's go! No! Oh, holy crap, look how fast we're going! Holy crap! <laughs> oh, what? What are you talking about, game? I was okay. I was going so fast. <laughs> Right, there's parrot lighting again. See if we can make it down to Tandio Ruins without crashing into too many walls. See if we can get to that um, Eagle Eye Shooting Park. See if we can do one more game or something. Whoa. Oh, perfect driving straight into a big boulder. <laughs> Alright, let's go down this cave. Here we go. Perfect. Where are we now? We have to cross the road, the bridge, crossing the river on the runs. Whatever I'm trying to say. We need to go back over here and go down here. Woohoo! Is that all fenced off? Yes, it is. I think we got the equestrian. Yes, we did. We got the equestrian. Um, we got an equestrian. Whatever it's called, a plaque. I think. I think it's called a plaque. Right. So let me know in the comment section what you guys think of Lake Tremilia. Now let me know what you think of the mountain resort at this time of day. Also, um, I guess with this like capture device I'm using, I'm, I'm using a new capture device, but I'm also using uh, Wii 2 HD. It's like you plug it into the back of your Wii and it lets you use a HDMI cable. So technically this is HD uh, upscaling. Gosh, let me know what it looks like. Uh, clay pigeon shooting, we did that. We haven't got the silver key for this, I don't think. Oh, I don't know. So let's see if we've got time to just do this one very quickly, just to end off the episode. Alright, so silver key. We need to play alone, clear all stages. Right. Start activity, play alone. Uh, we have done the five hit game, so what's this? Shoot an object once? This is going to be so easy. Right. Let's see if we can get these two done. Shoot as quickly as you can. Target time 0 0.50, half a second, man. Right. Wait until the count of five. Point down the Wii Remote. Two. Three. Four. False start! You're a loser! <laughs> oh, try again. It goes through this whole animation. I can't, like, skip it. Like, retry. 
Right, I know what I'm doing now. Give me a break. Whoa. Shoot the can. Alright, let's do it. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, 0 0.32, he's the champion. <sighs> That's it. That was it cleared. So our next one is going to be a tree hit one. Might as well do it now. Activity screen. That means we have everything done in the Eagle Eye Shooting Park. That's what it's called. Yes. Eagle Eye Shooting Park. Play alone. Tree hit game. Let's get this finished. Shoot as quickly as you can. I've got more time this time. Lucky Ratatouille. <laughs> Wait until the door's open. Oh! First one was good. Alright. Do we have to do the exact same one for this? No, it actually tells you, so. Let's just relax. Wait until the coin hits the barrel. Right. 0 0.31. That is impressive. That is freaking impressive. And hit the china plate. Surely can't miss this. What do we have to do? Wait until the count of five. Alright, this should be easy. Should be. Two. Three. Four. No! What does that mean? No! The china plate ruined my life. Oh, retry again. I was so close, I don't know why. I, w I went to get a really fast one. I Stupid. Alright, wait until the coin hits the barrel. Hmm. 0 0.35. That's okay. It's pretty quick. Right. Now, if that china plate comes up again and I miss, I'm gonna cry. I'm actually gonna cry. Zero point three seven, that's point zero zero two. Or is it point zero two actually? Slower than my first one. Yay, it's a tin can of lucky ratatouille. Alright, this is it. Wait until the door's open. Okay, that's fine. Zero point five five. So an average of zero point four two. What does that mean? It means cleared at an exclamation mark for my troubles. Alright, so if we could just locate our nunchuck again, get ready to get back to the information center, and we're going to leave the mountain resort, and we are going to be in a new resort for the next episode. So let's go to quit. That is a silver key done for all shooting ones. Is that going to be, because I've done everything in the Eagle Eye shooting park, will I get a special little present here? Let's have a look. Fingers crossed. Wow, you're quick. She's freezing, what's wrong with her? <laughs> Um, off-road car. Let's go. Oh, what? Nothing. I got nothing for that. Let's see. Let's just have a quick um, look to finish off the episode. Did we actually do all the shooting ones? Target shooting, quick draw, clay shooting, and rifle shooting. Yes, we did. Wow, how mean is that? How scroungy. I don't know if you say that over there, but wherever you're from. Get out of my freaking way. I'm in a bad mood now because I didn't get a silver freaking key. I mean, a present. <laughs> I did get a silver key. Right, we're going off to um, Lily's friend, the girly in blue. We're going back to the Villa Resort and we're going to have a look and see what we can do for the next episode. So I hope you come along and join me for that. Let me know as well if you enjoyed this episode. Leave me a comment. Let me know. Right, welcome. Here you can transfer between resorts. Would you like to visit another resort? Yes, we're going to the Villa Grounds to end off the episode. So I hope you enjoyed this episode on the Mountain Resort. It's been a while since we were here. And I hope you enjoyed the two episode special. Well, everybody, 
I hope you enjoyed this episode of Go Vacation. We're getting closer to the winter months, so expect a lot of snow resort gameplay coming soon. But um, for the next couple of episodes, I quite fancy going to the marine resort and getting some more games done. Uh, maybe some more deep sea diving. I hope you come and join me for that. Uh, until the next episode, bye for now.